Hi friends, today we are going to discuss about how to draw the state diagram. In the uh, question, we have to find uh, the forbidden latency and permissible latency collision vector. We found that found out as 1, 2, 5 as forbidden latency and remaining 3, 4 is permissible latency. Collision vector is 1, 0, 0, 1, 1. That is, we are placing one in all places of the forbidden latency. Now, we have to draw the state diagram. For drawing the state diagram, first we have to draw a table like this. State, initial collision vector, initial collision vector. Next is shift and next is out. That is which uh, which one is we are omitting or out new state. That is new stages are occurring or not. Okay. First state. Initial collision vector we know that 1 0 0 1 1. We have to write this 1 0 0 1 1. Net shift means right shift is occurring. For uh, your knowledge right shift means that is if the num value is like 1 0 0 1 1 we have to shift right that is placing this value in front okay that is 1 1 0 0 1 it will begin like this way in after the right shift okay we are uh, okay uh, after perform the performing the right shift we will get 1 1 0 0 1 and now we have to omit the first one that is 1 okay we are omitting the value 1 if it is 0 new state occurs new state occurs if it is 1 no new state occurs okay here look 1 therefore no new state occurs in next step now we have to write initial collision vector as this value okay before uh, and also you have to note that we will change this one as zero remaining will be same one zero zero one one zero zero one again we perform right shift it will become like one zero one zero zero now we have to omit this one that is again one there is no new state will be formed next at uh, next step we will again we have to write this one but it, this one will be 0 0 0 1 0 0 now perform right shift it will be it came like 0 0 0 1 0 and we have to omit this here look we are outing this one 0 so new state will be formed in a next step fourth step we have to write this one here it is 0 so we have we did not want to change it already we can write a 0 0 0 1 0 now we have to again perform right shift it will become like 0 0 0 0 1 now we have to omit this one look at this it will 0 so it will form a new state Again at fifth state, we have to write this one 0, 0, 0, 0, 1 and perform right shift. It will become like 1, 0, 0 and 0, 0. Now we have to emit this one. Here look at this one. Therefore, no new state is formed. Then at the sixth state, 1, 0, 0. We look at this one is there, so we have to convert it to 0. 0 0 0 0 0 and we have to perform right shift it will become like 0 0 0 0 now we have to omit therefore 0 come therefore new state is formed at uh, during the third fourth and sixth new state formed new state formed Therefore, now we have to perform OR operation during these three new state. Okay, first we can start with third state. At third state, we have to perform 
or operation or operation with initial collision vector initial collision vector okay during third state first we have to write one zero zero one one that is initial collision vector and we have to take the this value we have to take this value for performing the or operation that is zero 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 one zero if any one of the value is 1 then we can write 1 that is our operation 1 1 therefore it is 1 both are 0 therefore it is 0 both are 0 therefore it is 0 1 0 there is it is 1 ok during the 3 state we again got initial collision vector in during the 4th state we have to perform this value with initial collision vector that is one zero zero one one and this value zero 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 one we will get one one zero zero one again we got initial collision vector during the next new state that is sixth state we have to perform our operation with initial collision vector and this value that is 0 0 0 0 0 that is 1 1 0 0 1 again we got initial collision vector now we can draw the state diagram the state diagram is first we have to mark the initial collision vector that is 1 0 0 1 1 we have to draw it like this way and then we have to identify in which all state we get a new state that is third third one fourth state sixth one so we have to mark it like that way during the third state we got again initial collision vector so we have to self loop it that is again we have to uh, come in initial collision vector and during fourth state we again get initial collision vector we have to mark it like this way and during sixth state also we get initial collision vector 1011 then we have to mark it like this way okay now this is the state diagram for the this problem in next video i will explain how to find symbol cycle and greedy cycle and also along with that mal throughput etc thank you for watching